Hey there everybody, it's Mike Delisio with another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing. Today we're going to be taking a look at Southern Rails coming from Rio Grande Games. Three to five players in about an hour. Immense fields of crops soak up the bright sun on a hot day in the south. In Southern Rails, three to five players compete to own shares of stock in one of six railroads. So I'm uh, going to guess that this is I believe, and, and my ignorance was, will probably show here, although I've played a couple of games like this, I believe this is going to be what you would call a cube rails game. This is uh, what had been a winsome game that is now being brought over by um, Rio Grande games. There have been a number of these types of games, kind of variations on the theme here. Let's take a look at the components inside. We have got... Our player reference sheet here that kind of goes through the basics of the game and an end of round scoring example. Here we have our rule book, which is a very, very light rule book. The, uh, the games of these that I've played are very light in rules. There's not a whole lot involved as far as the actual rule set, but there is a fair amount of complexity within the decisions that are being made and usually a whole lot of player interaction that can uh, make your decisions even more challenging, okay? Here we have a sideboard, okay, with our different kind of things we're going, more green cities, most blue cities, most red cities, highest total revenue, uh, the different shares, I would imagine. Here is our board. Right. Let me zoom out a bit so we can see if we can get all that. Yeah, we got all of that in there. There you go. The different cities. Okay. And we've got some wooden components. Discs and cubes of various sizes and shapes and widths. All right. So just fine. Kind of what you would expect from a train game like this, just some nice functional wooden components. Let's take a look at the cards, which are going to essentially be the shares, I imagine. But it looks like we also have some player aid cards here. Let me zoom back in just a little bit. There we go, because there's some small text there. All right, one per player, and then we just have the different shares in the different lines. All right, well, I think that gives us a pretty good idea, and it's not a huge shock. Um, these games tend to have a particular aesthetic, and, and um, this kind of fits right in line with what you may have seen in the past. That is Southern Rails. Thank you for watching another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing.